This is a picture worth a thousand words. This A posted it recently. It says OBV. So on balance volume. You can see the AMC's price has went up. It's went down and, and so on and so forth. But as you can see in the blue, the OBV has remained very, very stable, meaning that a lot of the apes that have been holding are still holding. So what is it going to take for AMC stock to finally turn that corner and start moving towards the up and up? Planet of the Apes said, if you need any proof, the market is corrupt. Here is all you need to know in one screenshot. Also, let me know I'm holding the right one. AMC shorts are screwed, apes never leaving. And this ape honestly has a point because this post says Symark stock is up 87.6% in 2023 while AMC is down 69.6% and IMAX is up 26.4%. Shares of National Sci Media are up 92.3% this year, outpacing the S&P 500's gain of around 13.6%. The movie theater industry and everything that it surrounds hasn't making quite the comeback over the last year, but yet AMC stock is still lagging the rest of the competition. And in my opinion, and of course I could be wrong, this means that AMC could be one of the only stocks that still has a major opportunity for some more upside, but of course, only time will. This ape makes a really, really good point. They said Robinhood or Robinhood stock, down 90% since all-time highs, and media says nothing. Yet AMC has daily hit pieces. So way, way back a long time ago, Robinhood was pretty much the darling across the media, and a lot of certain TV personalities thought that Robinhood was going to be one of the best performing stock of all time, it seemed like. But as everything has been unfolding, it doesn't necessarily seem like that's the case here. Robinhood is down around 90%. AMC is also down past 90%. But why is everyone telling everyone? to sell AMC and not Robinhood. With AMC, you have a situation where the SEC Gov has given market makers a blank check to break as many laws as possible, to keep the naked shorting pot from boiling over. The collusion with Wall Street and others deserves DOJ and other high up authority attention. And I want you apes to do me a favor. Look at the last month's fails to deliver and tell me that data does not look absolutely insane. The SAPE says growth stocks like AMC perform better when inflation is low, considering how high inflation is right now the pressure that's putting on families. It's pretty remarkable that we are holding up this well, actually. Few have money to buy both AMC and April now. Next year could be better, in my opinion. This says, I'm glad the dude wants theaters to succeed. This is Tom Cruise. He says he would have held Top Gun Maverick for 10 years to secure a theatrical release. And this ape down below said it perfectly. Even if you have a home theater, and most of us don't, which I know I sure don't, and, and comment down below if you guys do, but... I don't think that many people really have a home theater. You would need to have a complete top of the line sound system to get near the same effect that you get on the big screen theater. With all others eating popcorn, etc. The seats, the sights, the aroma of hot butter popcorn, and the crowd reaction, and it still wouldn't be as good as you would get at home. Make sure to check out all these other videos to catch up on all the latest AMC stock DD and information you need.